y'all welcome back to my channel this is Jen's diary if you are new here thank you so much for tuning into my channel I hope that you will subscribe and join the community here for all of my returning subscribers y'all I love y'all so much for your support um, I'm Jen and today well just a little rewind here on my channel we talk about lifestyle experiences fashion style and really everything in between uh, but today is going to be a styling video we're going to go through some of my favorite fall trench coats on this video so stick around and let's talk about it so can we just get into how much I have missed y'all? I know there's been some of you who've been reaching out to me in DMs, even here on YouTube and also on Instagram that have been asking for the video. I'm going for it. We're going to have our two videos a week, but then we will also have some additional videos which will be on uh, weekly vlogs. So I'm going to commit to doing a weekly vlog where you're just going to spend the day with me and kind of see how I spend my days especially working from home um, there will be a lot of Target and a lot of home goods and a lot of uh, Starbucks and but also this year y'all I am going to try to thrift I have been talking about this with you all for a while I don't know how it's gonna go but I'm gonna take you with me um, my husband is like why are you still trying to do this thrifting but I am going to do it y'all and I'm gonna bring you all with me and we're gonna see what type of finds that we find here in the Bay Area so we're gonna do it this year y'all so I'm gonna bring you all with me but again we are going to have our regular videos on Tuesdays and Thursdays but then we'll also have an additional video which I haven't decided which day of the week yet that I'll post the weekly vlog it may be on Mondays I haven't decided quite yet if I'm gonna do Saturday to Saturday to Sunday or how I'm going to do uh, the cadence for the weekly vlogs but you can expect to have your two videos for the week which will likely be styling videos or date nights and things uh, but then also have a weekly vlog so I'm gonna stop rambling y'all and we're gonna get into my favorite trench coats and do a light styling on them all you all please tell me in the comments if you prefer to have more styling videos or if you like me to just talk about what I like and share the details and also to obviously share the links of where I purchased the things or if you want true styling videos so you let me know but we're just going to jump right into this favorite trench coat video today so stick around and let's just get right into this video Okay, so the very first trench that I have on my list today is going to be an amazing pop of color, a vibrant orange that I purchased from one of my most favorite boutiques that I shop at online. And this boutique is based in the UK. But y'all, get into this orange. This orange this is just everything so the um, the details of the trench it is a traditional trench it comes I would say a little longer than mid length maybe I'm 5'4 um, so it comes to almost my ankles it may come to the ankles we'll try it on um, but it's amazing I love 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 this trench coat I'm a trench coat girl if I were to pick what's my style aesthetic it would definitely be trench coats it would be leather and it also would be um, black and I would definitely say that is like my look my aesthetic I can do so much with just that pairing um, so anytime I see a fabulous trench I'm all over it and so this orange I didn't have anything orange and well no I take that back I have a Michael Kors peacoat that's orange but it's more of a burnt orange um, and I've only worn that peacoat maybe once um, I got it from Macy's a few years ago it was a really good deal and I hardly wear it but this trench is more lightweight um, but but also it has a little bit of weight to it so I definitely could say you can layer it um, but I love 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 this trench coat I just noticed there's like an inside pocket get into this inside pocket I didn't know was there okay 
So yeah, I love, love, love this trench coat. And it also has these little um, pulls here where you can cinch in the waist, which is amazing. And you can see the cinching detail here. Um, I just love like the pleating on this little flap here. I do not purchase Typically, I do not purchase a jacket, even a blazer jacket, if it does not have this slit in the back. I do not love any type of jacket, whether it's a crop jacket or, well, not a crop jacket. Crop jacket, you can get away with it, but if it's a blazer or anything longer than a blazer, I need to have this little slit here. I am not a fan of just like straight, straight jackets of any kind. So yeah but it has like these black buttons here um it has like the double breasted appeal with the black buttons it also has um some ties where you can make a cute little bow or you can cinch it has the same cinching detail here on the sleeve and it's a wide sleeve i love this and the color is so vibrant y'all i could not help but jump on this i love if i were to pick one of my favorite boutiques that i think are a little bit under the radar it would be the chemist and that's where i purchased them this from i have so many so many purchases from the chemist again they're in the uk and pretty much everything they're posting i'm grabbing because i just love the um the detail the um creativity the um you know just is more like a one-of-a-kind piece when i'm shopping with them and so i had to hop on this like i cannot talk highly enough about this trench coat so i'm a draper and it gets on my my husband's nerves but i'm definitely a draper i'll pop in a picture here i wore this trench coat for one only one time and that was last month for our trip to um, LA for Christmas and I wore this I may have had this dress on too but I paired it with some snake skin like a gray snake print uh, thigh boot and then also a gray snake print uh, oversized clutch and as you can see in this picture like i was really happy with this jacket i could not wait for us to go out so that i can wear it i had just received it in the mail i think a day or two before our trip and i was like are we still going to dinner <laughs> and my husband was like yes we're still going so get your jacket out so i wore this jacket i loved it um and it just it was just the perfect pop of color i got so many compliments that evening we went to Ocean Prime? No, not Ocean Prime. That was when we went to Miami a few weeks ago. Where did we go? Oh, we went to Catch. Yes, we went to Catch Steak in LA and I was able to wear this look and it was so cute and amazing. But I also love that you can actually wear this jacket. And again, the sleeves are a little oversized. Like I said, with the the uh, strings here, you can certainly cinch in the sleeves as well, or you can make a cute little bow. But y'all, look at this trench, it's amazing. So again, I had already kind of cinched in the waist a little bit so that it's not so uh, boxy, but you definitely can wear it open. You can wear it with some cute denim. You can wear it with um, joggers even. Uh, you know, you can wear it with your little lemon if you're coming from the gym. You can do so much dressing up and dressing down this trench coat. But again, the color is so vibrant. You can throw on some really cute oversized sunnies to really kind of elevate this look. But it's definitely multi-purpose, which I love. Um, these are really deep pockets here. Um, and I got it. I got my true size. I'm a 10 um, and a US 10. And I got my true size on this one. And again, I love it. So cute. So, so cute.
Okay, so the next trench coat that's on my list is going to be animal print. So I've been seeing that in some trends and some uh, research I've been doing, videos and things and, and runway, is that animal print is supposed to be making a comeback. And I'm like, when did it ever leave? Because I love, love, love animal print. So this next trench is going to be a tiger print. This trench coat is absolutely amazing. I purchased this trench a few years ago. I've only worn it one time. It is by Adam Lepes. I believe that's how you pronounce it, Lepes, L-I-P-P-E-S. And this trench coat is amazing. Um, they only had a size 12, which is not my size, but I was okay with it being a little oversized because I know how I would I will wear it. I will wear it in layers oftentimes. And so I was okay with it being a size larger. And also I'd rather have it large so that I can always have it tailored if needed. But the 12 actually worked for me. Um, I've only worn it one time. I wore it when we went to New York, I believe last year or year before last. Um, I had to go for work and we went to dinner to Maestro's in New York and it was cold. It was around 40 degrees, um, which is cold for us in the Bay Area. 40 degrees is cold to us. So I actually wore this with a black, uh, similar type of black sleeveless fitted dress with some white piping on the sleeves. It was long sleeves, it was like a sweater dress. And I wore it with this trench and it was amazing. But for the sake of styling in real time, I'm gonna just pair it with this same black dress that I've worn in another style we just did. But I'll pop in a picture of how I wore it in New York. So yeah, this trench is amazing. It's It has weight to it, it's very warm. It has a belt as well, which is the same tiger print. And it has a black loop that you can kind of loop it in. Uh, the sleeves are a nice length. Uh, it also has buttons, it has two functional pockets. And you know I'm gonna try to drape first. Uh, but I love, love, love it. It's a nice material. So yeah, it has, um, you know, long sleeves here. It has like a miniature version of this belt here on the sleeves, which I think is a really cute detail. Um, but you can, again, button it. There are two buttons here, it has a double breasted appeal. You can button on either side. Um, and then again, you have your long belt here which is great that it's really long so that you can grow into it, I guess you could say. Um, but yeah, it's a very cute, fun, um, oops, oh, and your pocket has a little button on it too, which is a cute little touch. Um, but I really like this uh, trench coat. It's very fun. Again, you can dress it up and down. You can wear it with sweats, with denim jean. Uh, you can also wear it with a dress, a skirt, you know, wear it to work, wear it to the gym. You can wear it in many different, for many different occasions, and I love that. And then you have this detail here, which is my absolute favorite part. Again, I love a slit in the back, but I love that it's like a faux slit, but it has like a little button here, a button loop, which I think is very cute. Okay y'all, so the next trench that is on my favorite list is going to be a nasty gal trench that you've probably seen a couple uh, in a couple style videos from other influencers and y'all, this jacket is one of my favorite jackets as well as a lot of my uh, peers have been saying because it is just so timeless. So I'm gonna just grab the jacket. And we are talking about this black nasty gal 
a trench jacket here. This jacket is so amazing, y'all. It has this white piping detail here. It is. It has a really nice weight to it. I purchased this jacket in a size 14, and I'm so glad I went up like a couple sizes. I think it's only because that's what they had available, but I'm glad I did because it fits great. And so um, I can always have it tailored if needed, but I can, I have more options and flexibility with how I can style it. Again, I can wear it similar to all the other trenches. I can wear it with sweats, with um, more dress down look, with denim, with a dress. I can just do so much with this. And I've worn this jacket so many times. I just, I love it. I've traveled with it and I love it. The only con for this jacket is that you do get some little scuffing on it. But again, I am definitely wearing this jacket out because it goes with so much. So today I'm just gonna pair it with these Good American um, vegan leather pants and they have some uh, rhinestone detailing all on the front panel and nothing on the back. And then I have this blue leopard print uh, turtleneck that I'm pairing it with with some Vince Komodo uh, booties uh, as well. So y'all, this jacket is just so effortless. You can do so much with this. Throw on some cute oversized sunglasses and this jacket and pajamas underneath it and you're still gonna be put together. Please don't wear pajamas outside, but I'm just saying that you can do so much with this jacket. It is sickening. So um, I'll have my, pipe, my uh, sleeves here and again, it has like uh, the belt detail on the sleeves. Um, it has buttons all the way down. Like I said, it's a lot of scuffing on here just because I wear it so much. And like I said, I've traveled with this jacket. I have done a road trip in this jacket. It's just everything. So I love it. Uh, the pockets are deep and it's just a cozy, very chic jacket. And I love, love, love this trench. This is going to be, I think it was on one of my styling videos from last year as a favorite. I'm just going to love this jacket until I've scuffed it up so much. I'm going to be kicking myself I didn't get a backup jacket. So it does come in a purple as well on Nasty Gale. I've had that purple one in my cart multiple times and then I just changed my mind. Um, because I don't know that I would love the purple as much as I love this black one. Especially because of the material. But I don't know. I'll check and see if it's still there, but there is black and purple that comes in this jacket. Um, and again, this is a 14 US and I am a size 10 US, but it still fits very well. So, you know, make your decision on the size that works for you. But I normally just tie the belt in this type of manner and just go and I love it. Okay, so the next trench coat on my favorite trench coat list is going to be this faux fur, amazing, warm trench that I wore only one at a time. Again, when I went to New York, it was in, I want to say March of last year and it was cold. And so this was a perfect, warm, fashionable uh, jacket to wear at that time. I had just picked it up from Express and at first when I was looking at it, I was like, is this the right fur that I want to get, uh, faux fur that I want to get? But I really did like it and I paired it with this look that I just recreated. Um, I have on this uh, bodysuit, which is also from Express with some Good American denim and not this exact pair. I actually just got these in the mail the other day. Um, and I have on these gray faux snakeskin uh, thigh boots, but I have them rolled all the way down as booties right now. Um, but it was great to wear it and I paired it as such. So I just wore this Fendi back crossbody 
and this is the Express jacket. I got it in an XL. It must have been all that was available because this is already oversized, but it actually looked fine. So I have a long belt here that you can tie if you choose. I did not wear, I think I did tie it because again, it was cold. Um, but you don't have to tie it, you can tie it in the back. Yeah, you can totally tie it in the back and I think that is the way I would style it here in the Bay Area because it doesn't get this cold <laughs> typically. Uh, normally we're in the 60s year round, uh, but sometimes it does get in the 50s. Um, I love it, it's super warm. It may still be in stock. It was from last year, but I saw it on their website for a long time after, and obviously it went on a deep, deep sale. I did not purchase it on sale, but again, I think it is something that you really can style up, especially with denim, and get a look. So this is gonna be it. Okay, so our final, final favorite trench coat for the season is going to be a little bit of a curveball, um, but I love, as I mentioned, I love trench coats. I love um, just any item that has like a different appeal to it and is something that could be seen like kind of out of the box. So this is going to be a military or army green um, like uh, puffer trench coat and I love 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 this trench coat. It's by Sarah Battaglia but I love this puffer trench coat. It is, it goes to my ankles as far as length. Again, I'm 5'4", and it's super, it has a weight to it, but it's also kind of lightweight, um, and I love that. But it definitely is kind of like a flare trench, um, and it's fabulous. And so you can definitely do a lot with this trench as with the others you can. Um, but I'm just going to keep this one kind of like simple. I'm gonna pair them just, I'm just gonna wear what I have on right now. I have on these my favorite, favorite, favorite uh, faux leather uh, leggings that I've talked about a ton. Y'all gonna get sick of seeing these pants, but I love them. And I actually purchased a, a, a backup pair <laughs> because I love them so much. So I don't think I'm wearing the same pair all the time. And I do take them to get dry cleaned. So, um, but anyway, I love, love, love this look just keeping it kind of simple black uh, and then I'm going to pair them with some black Steve Madden dupe uh, Givenchy dupes I love these two y'all I've only worn these once um, and I got them this season and they have like a snake skin print I think they came in red also that's the pair that I really wanted um, but they were sold out so I'm hoping I'll be able to get those at some point um, but I'm just gonna pair it with this and then um, my Fendi crossbody as well and we'll have a look this look y'all super effortless again it's puffer so it can definitely be casual brought all the way down uh, but you also can turn it into a cute date night look like we have going right now so yeah I'm just gonna toss this bag with it I don't think I'm gonna wear it crossbody since it, I'm trying to give the vibe of more of a date night um, so I would definitely tuck the chain inside and just wear it as a top handle and get into this look. But it has this wide collar here as you see. Um, it does not have a belt and so you can't um, kind of tie it in. It's just supposed to be open. It does have a little button somewhere. I don't even know what this button is. Um, but it'll go like this and you have two functional pockets here on either side, uh, but it's just fabulous.
so again thank you so much for tuning in to this video today we will have another video this week uh, coming up another styling video and then we'll also close out the week with a weekly vlog so I'll definitely uh, be much more consistent this year and beyond uh, but as always I thank you for tuning in please be sure to like comment and subscribe if you are newly visiting my channel and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.